Well, isn't this wonderful? So apparently these are the checkpoints. And I should only quit when I'm on one of these things. Uh, but I, I actually loaded this earlier and was wondering what the hell. And did I lose the progress? No. I lost a bit. I don't know what bit. This is the place we went through. I can now actually first spawn new enemies. But I can actually just run past them and go through this place. But instead of getting back to the hotel... Hotline chamber. I go to hotline chamber. And... Yeah, this looks like it was supposed to, does it? Wait a minute. Oh! It actually does let me back here. I just ran past the last time. And now it crashed. No, it didn't crash. It brought me back on the desktop for some reason. I wonder if I'm still recording. Because that is actually the second time it did that. I wonder. Yeah, I'm supposed to be recording still. So... Apparently it likes to hop back to desktop at times. For some reason, no? Yeah, there's nothing here. I just ran past the last one. I wonder... Yeah. Okay, so there's no nothing lost. I stopped the game here. So I can continue from here like nothing ever happened. Oh, smokes! Why are these people here? What reason might you have to be hanging around this place? Whoa. Hello. Okay. Well, that was fun. Now I trust the office. God damn it. Back to the office. Oh, and there's a document. <clears throat> Federal Bureau of Control to all executive staff. I know there is some concern regarding our operations exceeding the annual budget. So long as we operate within the oldest house, we are obscured, by, uh, obscured from scrutiny in many respects. If our budget demands are not exorbitant to the point of drawing attention, then they will be granted by the U.S. Treasury without question. The FBC is just another line. FBC for oh, FBC is just another line in another spreadsheet that some lowly accountable won't even notice. Federal Bureau of Control, FBC. Their eyes will skip over us, as if we weren't even there. The nature of the oldest house allows us certain freedoms in how we operate. Our being here is no accident. Regards, Zechariah Trench, Director of the Federal Bureau of Control. I hope I haven't... Oh, I haven't seen that before because I pick, pick things up as I find them. Uh, speak with Emily. Emily was right next door, I, s I stink. I stink she's right here downstairs though. Oh, I can... No, I can't access level 4. Ooh, there were level 1 doors. 
Should I check them out or leave them for later? Why not check them out if I can access them now? Because there's one right here. Which I can now open. And there's upgrades and files. Agent death notification. Federal Bureau of Control. Dear Mrs. and... Okay. Dear Mr. and Mrs. Potts. I regret to inform you that your son Graham Potts was killed in active duty this past week. While the details surrounding his death are classified, I am honored to tell you that he died in the service of his country. You can be proud of his courage in the face of danger and his commitment to protecting our nation's greatest enemies. Uh, what? <laughs> to protecting our nation against her enemies. He will be remembered by his comrades and colleagues. I sincerely regret the pain this message will bring you. Take some solace in knowing that his sacrifice helped protect the country he loved so much. His effects will be returned to you with all speed. Sincerely yours, Howard J. Murray, Deputy Chief of Communications, Federal Bureau of Control. Potts died. Potts. Graham Potts. I seem to remember reading about Graham Potts earlier. Now that it's a different day, I can't really say for sure. No, this is not that. Um, case files? No. Was he in the butt? No. Was he in the butt? Holy smokes. Grandpots. Maybe the pots and butt remind me of each other so much that I thought maybe I've seen pots before. Maybe someone talked about pots. Is this about pots? No. No pots. Book of Samson. Huh. Well, maybe it was the butt thing. Okay, so I got some more stuff that I can't read. But wasn't there one downstairs even? Was it downstairs or was it... Oh no, this is central executive. Uh, I can't remember where I've been. I mean, who could? In a place this large. Apparently I haven't... Oh. It's just the tape. I'll probably listen to the tape. These are open doors. Oh, okay, let's just go to Emily. Before I get lost. Wait. Huh? Huh. Every place reminds me of some different place. It's kind of odd. That door I've opened. Was there any... Th there's a red door. I mean red light by the door. Maybe that's something I can open. Yes. And it's just a small mail room. It's actually an office. Does it... No, it's just a room. Oh, there's a board room right next to me. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That's where <laughs> that's where Emily is. Waiting. And there's a file. Para utility. Oh, again, his corrupted agent. The his manifest. Wait, I was supposed to be para utility. 
Oh, did I read the, re the wrong thing? The last thing I found? Because I went with what came up. I don't know. So, examination of paranatural topics, objects of power and their para-utility. Summary. Objects of power are unique in their capacity to grant certain individuals paranatural abilities. We call these individuals para-utilitarians. The potency of these abilities depends on the para-utilitarian. Using the reducted object of power as an example, some para-utilitarians can achieve a throw distance of reducted, while others are only capable of as little as reducted. What exactly determines an individual's paranatural competence is unknown, but it is largely believed that some reducted exists within the body and that, like all muscles, it can be exercised. To continue my analysis, I have officially requested access to the Northmore records. Considering he is one of the most accomplished paratilitarians the Bureau has ever seen, Dr. Darling is still considering this request. Okay. For sure. So I can exercise my my redacted something like it was a muscle. Goody. What is in here? Hello. And there's low health boost. Where is it? Excuse me. Where did it go? Weapon mod? <coughs> ah, damage while low on health. Plus 41. What's on now? Reload efficiency. Well, I guess this over overrides the reload. <coughs> Um, what did I put in? I put the thing back in. Uh, low health boost. That's it. We're golden. We are golden. Hey, there's a... Is that Emily? No. No, that's one of the guys. And he's wearing... What the hell was that called? Well, it's not Hans. It's, uh... Can't talk to you? Really? I would've loved to. What the hell was that thing called that they're wearing so they don't get affected by the things? Is there any doors back here? Three. Have I been through here? Am I supp I don't think I'm supposed to be here at this point. There's a jukebox. Well, of course there's a jukebox in a cage. Hannibal Lecter was in cage like one of these, but I guess there's glass. There's, there's probably glass. Maybe Hannibal needs some music. So they got him a... Uh, there's a walkie-talkie, I can't even pick that up. Yeah, maybe Hannibal wants some music. Sector elevator. Uh, I have probably used it. Are you Emily? No. Where the hell did the boardroom go? Is it upstairs? Because this... This ain't it. I think it's... Uh, upstairs. Yeah, there, there it is. Just one flight up. Jesse! Did you get the hotline? I mean, how is it out there? The comms? The hiss? I, sorry. You made it. I'm glad. Emily? Yeah. Let's talk. I got the hotline. I can make out what Trench is saying now. Incredible. What did he say? He talked about his management team. People who knew the Bureau's secrets. 
Your boss, darling. Tomasi, but he's gone. He has gone. Salvador? He's the head of security. And Marshall? Helen Marshall is head of operations. She's tough, ex-CIA. She took her rangers and went to the research sector to secure the HRA production. She hasn't come back. Someone who could help us. The other sectors. How do I get there? It's impossible because of the internal lockdown. You can perform a directorial override to lift it, but that can only be done in the maintenance sector. Normally, you take the sector elevator down there. It connects all the sectors, but it won't work while the lockdown is in effect. Of course. We already got past one lockdown. Maybe I can find a way. Jesse, look, with no prep, no training, in this extreme situation, you are doing phenomenally well. And all that and the hiss can't seem to affect you. I mean, I would love to run some tests on you. If you agree, that is. We could find out something that would help us. Tests? I don't know. She might find out about you. But I wouldn't mind understanding more myself. Okay. If you think it will help. Great. I'll check the internal documentation for any lockdown bypasses. We need to get these sectors open to locate Darling and Marshall. And I'll look for a way inside the maintenance sector. The sooner we find one, the sooner I reach this override. The hell was that? Upgrade and unlock new abilities from the nearest control point. Oh. Search for a way into the maintenance sector. I can hear Ahti again. What's this file? Research and records. Part 1. Confidential. Initial encounters with the entity known as the Hiss have revealed various behavioral facts. Most notably, the Hiss is able to invade or corrupt control points, altered, I altered items and even humans, radically changing their behavior. Curiously, any person wearing one of the wearable HRA, that's it, that's HRA, I can't figure what that means, but it's HRA, not Hans. Devices that Dr. Darling has been distributing over the past weeks was not affected by this corruption. The only known exception to this fact is the new director, Jesse Faden, who possesses an inherent immunity to the Hiss. This could indicate that she has already been corrupted, but her behavior is so in contrast to that of the other Hiss that I have dismissed the theory. My final observation comes from Miss Faden herself. She is able to cleanse material and organisms of the his corruption. We tested this ability on a his corrupted entity, but unfortunately the process seems to kill the host. Perhaps the host's physiology becomes reliant on the his. More work to be done. Refer to file redacted for full report. All right. Uh, does it? I hope I'm wrong. But I just... During the cutscene... I started thinking maybe Ahti. Maybe Ahti is the... 
Well, the bad guy in this story. Launch efficiency. Of course. I pressed the wrong key. I was pressing... I don't even know what that's called. Uh, energy boost. What am I wearing? Uh, health boost. Energy boost. And launch energy cost minus seven. Wait a second. <coughs> I think at some point I was wearing energy recovery speed. Possibly. Thinking that it would heal me faster, but it's actually for the telekinesis thingy. Yeah, <laughs> so I was using that for nothing. Launch energy cost. Health plus seven. Uh, if I run out of launch energy, I'll switch. Now let's go see the upgrade thing. Do you hear that? Someone's singing. Oh. Where's right. it coming from? I'll go look. Yeah, I was supposed to ask if there's anything to talk about. Hi, Jesse. No, apparently not. We've gone over this. Thanks, Emily. I'm sure I'll have more questions soon. Just let me know. I sure will. This is so strange. I mean... Two likable characters in the video game. That is so hot. And there's probably more. Sounds like it's coming from the elevator. Yeah, but let's check out the upgrade thingy first. Pope wants us to get a field lab set up as soon as possible. With what? We can't get any equipment from the research sector until the internal lockdown is lifted. And see what you can find around here. Computers, documents, any measuring devices you can find. Helping Pope is a surefire way to get on Darling's good side. Is Darling still around? Oh, because the videos looked so old that I thought maybe Darling's gone. Like, long gone. Abilities, astral constructs. Board counter measures. Okay, abilities. We have abilities. How is 10% health ability? Well, I guess it is. Plus 10 to energy. Plus 10 to melee. Plus 25 to launch damage. I'm gonna take that. Sure. Oh, I have points. Three points left. Okay. So I could take three more um question what are astral constructs weapon forms mods so i can make this the shatter shatter has high stopping power with a scatter shot that dev devastates grouped enemies at close range but i don't have the materials for it I need 5,000, I only have 4,300. Oh, undefined reading. So they are not for reading, they're for crafting. Intriguing. Mods. Ooh. Obscured weapon mod. Construct a random weapon mod. Well, sure. Obscure weapon mod. Well, this only takes... Wait, what? Oh! Wait. So it uses one out of eight and 
thousand out of four thousand. This is much more expensive. It uses uh, undefined reading instead of house memory. But they're all obscured. What about personal ones? Random personal mod. Upgrade. Upgrade to enable higher tier mods. So it uses... I need threshold... Th threshold fulfillment. Refresh mods. Refreshing mods. I don't understand this. <coughs> this I understand, but I can't do, so... I could just test, but it still uses thousand materials. That seems like a lot for just testing. Also, what the hell are these materials? I mean sources. Where do I get them? Board countermeasures, what the hell is that? Shatter maneuvers. Ah, uh, so these are like side quests or achievement type of things. Point being, oh, I get random mods as rewards. So kill enemies with the service weapon in shatter mode. Can't do that. Kill enemies with the service weapon in spin mode. Can't do that. Ex uh, kill his guards in the executive sector using spin. Can't do that. Use peers. Can't do that. Kill enemies in the executive sector with headshots. Okay. Executive sector. Oh. I can accept that. Because that's something I can do. Um, I don't suppose I have any outfits, no. More abilities. Oh, I can go further in the same thing. So I could actually take a couple steps more health and a bit of energy. Or I could go just one level at a time. What is this? Launch explosives. Cookie. Uh, should I do this balanced? Because it's only energy, it's only health, it's only melee, and it's only launch plus. Mal Ooh! Launch enemies. Aha! Uh -huh. So I can just kill them by launching themselves. Large enemies with. Ooh, baby. When do I open this one? Oh, do I have to have hold this row to open this one? Oh, there's more stuff to come. Hey, there's more stuff to come. Ground slam. Hello. While levitating. I can't really levitate. At least I haven't found the key for it. Ooh, so... <laughs> what to do when you do not know? Maybe for the first one I'll go level. So I'm 10% better at everything, plus 50 more on this. Seems feasible. Additional weapon form slot. Hey. Hmm. 
あー So how do I Oh, use 11 ability points to unlock personal mud slots. Yes. Holy smoke, I think I think this is a lot longer game than I was expecting. Yeah, for now, let's go see the elevator. Situation's getting worse. I saw Trench and Darling arguing a couple weeks ago. Trench was furious. You don't think Darling. Don't be stupid. What would the Bureau's golden child have to gain from killing the boss? No comments on that, I suppose. Uh, search for a way into the maintenance sector. But if Achti is singing in the elevator, let's have a look see. Time to work. Meet me in the maintenance. Maintenance it is. Oh, of course I could go to executives. Wait, am I at the exec? Whoopsies, wrong key. Oh, this is the executive section. What if I went and hunted down 10 headshots? Or was it headshots ki headshot kills? God damn it. Jeez, the menu, which is odd. Collectibles. What did I... Haven't I... Unread. Vodka. What is this? Okay. What was I supposed to, uh, missions? This guy. Kill enemies with headshots. Um, yeah, let's try that first. Let's find some enemies. See if I can... Hey, I can pull a weapon out here. Where would I find enemies? Is cafeteria executive sector? Probably. Because the dudes I killed in the beginning came from the mail room area. Maybe there's new dudes. Was it this way? No, it's that way. Let's have a quick look see, and if I can't find anything, I'll just edit it out. Oh, there's actually one door I can enter. And it has... Undefined reading. I have 16 now. Seek shelter. Okay. Yeah, that's something. Oh. But if he doesn't have a shield, I really shouldn't use throw. So I've got one.
Really? Only one. Oh, maybe they'll spawn. Oh, there's one. Let's try and give him a treatment with a pistol. That's two. Oh, let's have the health. Actually, I'm quite low on health, so... Let's use that. Um, get out of the... That place. So I lose quite a lot of health, quite fast. If I take fire. What a surprise. Oh! Oh. I could weaken them down maybe a little. Oopsies. Oh, that kills him. Boop, 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 boop. That just outright kills him. So that's not good. Holy smokes. Get those healths. Health, health, health. Two more. Oh, so don't tell me it spawns only ten enemies here because of that challenge. <laughs> Wouldn't that be great? I think that's exactly what it did. Oh, I haven't been here either. What's going on behind that door? Havana summary. An auditory event occurred at the United States Embassy in Havana injuring the majority of diplomatic staff stationed there. Redacted deaths were reported and the outgoing information has been managed. Event response. <coughs> Bureau agents arrived at the embassy on the same day as the event was reported through federal channels, but were too late to witness the awe, which is reported to have been redacted. Staff experienced sudden intense vibrations and noise accompanied by an intense pressure in the ears. This lasted for redacted minutes. No visual phenomena was witnessed. The scene was cordoned off and... Uh, cordoned off and the embassy staff were transported to the continental US. After formula I-9 was resided in the vicinity, a single cowboy boot began to vibrate, identifying it as an altered item. The item was contained and brought to the Bureau for examination. Single cowboy boot. Alrighty. Is it in this shelter? This looks like I'm not supposed to go in there. And I have no clue what to do about it. Does that help? Maybe I need more fire extinguishers and stuff. Hey, open the door. I don't think it helps. 
Okay, I have to do that later. There's something up there. Yes, there is. What are you? Undefined reading. Huh. Is that a file or is that just a... Oh god. It is a folder, but... Uh, can't do anything with it. Also, there's a red, red door up there. Isn't that where I came from? Hey, health. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I could have used two more enemies. <laughs> yeah, it says it's locked, but it's blown away. <laughs> Okay, so where the hell do I find two more enemies? Uh, well, oh, there's no fall damage, uh, at least not there. That let us comps. Would it would would comms be? Maybe the dark areas. Hmm, maybe at the dark areas I get more enemies. So let's check the dead letters. Hello. Yeah, this is still executive sector. Yes, there's Oh, smokes. Holy smokes. Now I can leave. Basically, I could leave. All the same, I can take care of these guys. All the smokes, there's a lot of them. There was another one somewhere. Is he now behind me? Saw him running. Yes, I did. There he goes. There's another one. Let's get closer. Finishing. What the hell is this? Ooh, ammo refund. House memory. Ah, so I actually get more stuff from tough enemies. Is this an endless spawn place? Holy smokes. I'm leaving now. I'm leaving now. Even though you wouldn't like me to, I'm leaving now. Getting the hell out of here. That's not what I wanted. Is this even where I came in? I think it should be. Oh yeah, it is. Are they gonna follow me the whole way through? 
I would think not. I, I think this should be a safe place. I think that. They say the new director can launch objects up to 20 feet. A bit longer than that. You never recorded any distance over five. Obviously, you never read the P6 data. I heard my shoulder, apparently. Well, her shoulder. So is there anything odd here now? Bot counter message. Collect reward. Weapon mod. Reload efficiency. Okay. I have it already, so... That's done. What else? Shatter? Spin? Uh, spin. Pierce. And shatter. So, no go. Ability points I don't have. Astral constructs. Well, I could... What? I could do the shatter. Should I do the shatter? Is the question. Is it worse than the pistol? Does it change the pistol? Or does it just have different modes? I guess is the question. Uh, that's annoying. Not knowing. I have no idea. I have no idea. Now, I have another question. If I was now to quit the game, would it continue from here? Uh, let's do a scientific experiment. I'll quit the menu. Last checkpoint. Does that count as a checkpoint just entering it? Or do I have to actually open it? Or do the thing? Let's see. Well, it continues from here, which is a good sign. Uh, I'm not sure, but I, I, I think that's how it works. Let's go see... Ahti, the dude. And they're talking again when I walk away. Which is annoying. Oh, I didn't check the mods. Because I have now reload efficiency, ammo refund, exclusive to spin, shatter and grip. Because uh, it said somewhere that the weapon... I can't remember, does something like it changes forms, but do I have a button to change those forms? Like when I change it to shatter or spin, do I have a button to press to get back to grip? Or is it one of those? I don't know, I'd like to. And this is just for shatter. Refund chance, refund chance, reload speed, damage while low on health. This may have saved me just there. And personal mods, <coughs> health plus 16. Launch energy cost. I was going low on the launch energy actually. Now that I had some uh, tougher enemies. But it's launch cost minus seven or energy recovery plus 19. Which one is better? I 
do not know. Let's put that thing in and hope that I don't die immediately when I come up with some person to kill. Maintenance sector access corridor. Like I said before, the janitor is a friendly face. Yeah, let's hope so. The maintenance sector is the janitor domain. If I can find Ati here, he can help me reach the override. Maybe it was you who got me into the oldest house with the lockdown on. Maybe it was Ati. It felt like he made the elevator appear that took me to Trench's office. Is Ati guiding me too? You? Am I you? Who is you? Find Ahti. Ahti! Where the fuck are you? Ahti Bill. Can't access this place because I don't have the card for it. Hey, that sounded like a uh, Half-Life thing. Ventilation janitor. Janitor's office is probably at the office. Oh! That's not good. The directorial override is right there, in the control room. How do we get there? That's a good question. Ventilation. When in doubt, scream and shout. One, two, three, four, five, six dudes hanging in there. Oh no. I smell a fight. I smell a fight. I'm gonna hit him with a speaker. He probably has friends, and I just took out my cover. Or I think that could have acted as my cover. Oh, that's not gonna work. To make it up the stairs to get some health. To get more health. Oh, I can clear this place. Is there anything to do before that? Do 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 no. Okay, let's Clear it. And I think that should act as a checkpoint. I truly hope so. Uh, 